Moving on, uh, adding fuel to the debate over the WHO's complicity as far as the pandemic is concerned. A bombshell charge by German news outlet Der Spiegel. The report cites the country's uh, intelligence service and claims that China urged the WHO to delay a global warning about the coronavirus outbreak. As per the report, German intelligence found that Chinese President Xi Jinping and Dr. Tedros, the WHO chief, spoke to each other. This was on the 21st of January via a telephonic conversation in which the Chinese president urged the WHO chief to hold back information about a human-to-human -human transmission of the virus and to delay a pandemic warning. The World Health Organization has rejected these claims. It said in a tweet that there was never such a telephonic conversation that took place between the two. It has even called the charges unfounded and untrue, quote-unquote. The health agency goes on to say that China confirmed human-to-human -human transmission of the virus on the 20th of January, while the organization declared the same on the 22nd of Jan. The coronavirus was officially classified as a pandemic in the month of March. According to German intelligence estimates, China's attempt to suppress this crucial information about the pandemic cost the world four to six weeks precious time that could have been used to fight the virus. U.S. President Donald Trump has repeatedly accused the health agency of playing to what he calls Chinese propaganda. His administration has also moved to halt aid to the body. Additionally, Donald Trump has called for an investigation into the WHO's role in the spread of the virus. In the past, Donald Trump has accused the WHO of being China-centric and also called it a pipe organ for Beijing. However, its claims of the virus having originated inside a Wuhan lab have also been dismissed by the Five Eyes Intelligence Network, comprising agencies from the US, UK, Canada, Australia and New Zealand.